Hello guys, it's your girl Tash Lux again and I say welcome to another episode on my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a lock tie. A lock tie is an accessory which is used to pack the locks or thread. It can also be used on hairs, braids and more. So if you want to know how to make this, I advise you to stay to the end of this video to see how I made it. Thank you to those who subscribe to my channel and you're still here with me. And to those who are just coming to this channel for the first time, are you about to start your log journey or you want to know more about logs or you are on logs and you're looking for how to make different accessories to beautify your logs, then this channel is for you. I would like you to click on the subscribe button, turn on the bell notification so you can get alerts when I post more videos. So let's go into the video for today. I love you guys. So yeah, the tools we'll be using for to make the lock tie for today. First, we we'll have this wire which you can get in an electrical shop or if you have in the house. Next is this twine colorful accessories which is used to decorate braids. You can get different colors as you want and as much as you want if you want to be very creative. Then next we have a candle which I'll be using to smoothen the body. Then a piece of fabric. You can use any fabric that you want. You can use silk, satin, any fabric of your choice. Just be very creative with it. So here's my second fabric because I'm going to be showing you two different ones which I've been making in this video. So the next thing to do is to take those wires and to twist them together on each other twist them properly and allow it to be very firm. If you can twist yours and you find it hard to twist, you can use a plier to twist them around together. So you can see I'm twisting them in this video. That's how you're going to do it. So when you're done twisting the wires together, it's going to look like this. You take your fabric, wrap them properly around the wire. You have to wrap them properly around the wire so the fabric isn't loose. You have to make it firm and tight. As you can see, I'm wrapping it and I'm pulling the fabric so the fabric can be firm on the wire. So I'm trying to cover it properly so there won't be any part which is opened and the fabric can look neat for a finishing result. So I just keep on wrapping it here and I'm going to be doing this till I get to the end of the wire. So if you're like me and your fabric get exhausted and at a point and you're not done wrapping the fabric on the wire, you can get extra fabrics and keep on wrapping it. All you just need to do is make the part where you're attaching the next fabric to to be very neat when you're wrapping it and all the edges of the fabric shouldn't be showing. So you need to wrap your fabric properly so you can get a finished look so your finishing look can be nice and firm so this is me i keep on wrapping the fabric around the wire till i get to the end of the wire so now i'm done wrapping the fabric around the wire and here is what we have the kit is looking so nice and now I'm going to take the accessory, the hair accessory, I got the colorful one and I will twist the wine color around the fabric to just beautify it. You can use more than one colors, just get creative with yours and now I'm going to be sealing the mouth with a candle, just a bonnet and to make it not lose and last longer. So that's what I did, I just got creative here and decided to just like 
with their accessories at the mouth and yes the final look looks so beautiful so now i'm going to be showing you how to make another one with wool so yeah i want to do a jamaican color and i did the same thing i did before which is wrapping a piece of clothes around the wire i wrapped a gold piece of clothes around this wire but i'm going to be covering it with the wool i just wanted to give it a firm braid so now i took the first color which is the green and i wrapped it around the clothes make sure to cover the cloth properly so they didn't see that there's a material at the base except you want to use the material as a design also and you want people to see it then you don't need to cover it up but yeah i don't want people to see the material so i'm covering it up with my wool of different colors first i used green then yellow then red because i wanted a jamaican lock tie so i kept on wrapping this and wrapping it and i was being creative with it at the end here yeah, i bounced it you don't need to tie this that is another way to do it i realized that you don't need to tie it you can just Bond them out of the accessory and when it's still hot you just place it on the, the other ones and it stays there, stays glue very strong. This is the final result. So here's me using it to wrap my hair and showing you how it's when you just have to coil it around your hair in any style that you want and it's going to stay firm and you can use it to pack your hair in different ways. I hope you've loved this and I hope you find this video very helpful and you can tell me in the comment section what you think about this and if you tried it and how it looked on you. Thank you. And here are my beautiful set of lock ties. Let me know in the comment section when you make yours. Bye.